The History of Reynard the Fox by William Caxton stands as an iconic piece in the literary realm, recognized for its allegorical depth, social commentary, and multifaceted characters. This medieval beast fable weaves a complex tapestry of themes, morals, and satire while portraying the cunning yet morally questionable protagonist, Reynard. Caxton's work is embedded with allegorical representations that mirror human traits and societal norms. The animals in the narrative embody human qualities, serving as allegories for various social classes and character types. Reynard, the sly and manipulative fox, personifies both intelligence and deceit, representing the cunning yet morally ambiguous aspects of humanity. His interactions with other characters such as the noble Lion King, the naive rabbit, and the greedy wolf highlight the complexities of social dynamics and moral ambiguity. The narrative structure of Reynard the Fox follows a series of adventures and misadventures that Reynard undergoes, showcasing his wit in escaping dire situations and manipulating others for his gain. Caxton employs a rich tapestry of storytelling techniques, including vivid imagery, dialogue, and suspenseful pacing, which captivates the reader's attention throughout the tale. The use of anthropomorphic animals engaging in human-like behaviors allows Caxton to comment on human nature and society in a satirical yet relatable manner. Morality and ethics emerge as central themes in the narrative, inviting readers to contemplate the blurred lines between right and wrong. While Reynard is portrayed as an unscrupulous trickster, his intelligence and resourcefulness often lead to his success, blurring the boundaries of morality. Through Reynard's actions and interactions, Caxton prompts reflection on the ambiguous nature of virtue and the moral complexities inherent in human behavior. Moreover, the narrative serves as a social commentary on the medieval society of Caxton's time. The interactions between the characters reflect hierarchical structures, political maneuvering, and the abuse of power. Reynard's ability to outweet and manipulate those in positions of authority challenges traditional power dynamics, offering a critique of the prevailing social order. Additionally, the character development within the story is multifaceted. Reynard evolves from a cunning trickster to a complex figure whose actions prompt moral introspection. His interactions with other characters lead to moral dilemmas, forcing readers to confront their own ethical judgments. This evolution in character challenges simplistic notions of good and evil, presenting a nuanced portrayal of human nature. In conclusion, The History of Reynard the Fox by William Caxton transcends its medieval origins to offer a timeless exploration of human nature, societal norms, and moral ambiguity. Through allegorical storytelling, rich characterization, and astute social commentary, Caxton crafts a narrative that continues to resonate with readers across generations. Reynard's cunning, the intricate web of moral dilemmas, and the satirical portrayal of societal hierarchies collectively contribute to the enduring significance of this literary masterpiece.